Hi, I'm Heidi, a physical therapist over at Ballard Rehab Hospital, and I'm here today to talk to you about NDT, which is short for Neurodevelopmental Treatment. This is a technique used by physical, occupational, and sometimes speech therapists to help patients as they're recovering from stroke. It can also be used with neurological diagnoses such as multiple sclerosis, Parkinson's, and traumatic brain injury. With this technique, the therapists analyze movement as the patient is performing functional activities and determine which components are missing in order for the patient to be able to more functionally do the activity and with better efficiency and more normally. Activities include things such as getting in and out of bed, moving from one surface to another, standing up, sitting down, walking, and just everyday activities that people enjoy doing. Once this analysis is complete, the therapist will either facilitate a muscle or movement um, that is lacking or weak in order for the patient to get multiple repetitions of practice and perform the activity better. Or they might have to inhibit a movement or muscle um, that is overactive so the patient can perform it more efficiently um, and more normally. The one thing I love about NDT is the personal component in integrating what a patient loves into their treatment. An example from my own therapy career was a patient I worked with recovering from stroke and we were working on upright sitting posture and building sitting endurance. She could only tolerate the activity for about 30 seconds. I asked her husband what she enjoyed doing before stroke and he said sewing. So I brought in my sewing kit and had her sort the spools of thread by color and she was able to tolerate the activity for 30 minutes. This allowed her muscles in her trunk to all be strengthened and improve her endurance to serve as a foundation to work on more higher level and advanced tasks. NDT is a technique that allows patients to regain their independence, reach their fullest potential as they recover from stroke and get back to doing the things that they love.